Hey everybody, this is Brett with Summit Auto in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Grand Cherokee headquarters. And today I am super excited to show you this brand new, our very first 2021 Jeep Grand Cherokee L edition. So this one has the third row. It also has the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 motor which pumps out 293 horsepower, 260 foot-pounds of torque. It's gonna to get you 25 miles per gallon on the Highway 18 City and then combined total of 21 miles per gallon. This is a Summit Reserve package. So this one has just about every option you could get. And it is in silver Zenith um, paint. So it's got a little bit of metallic to it. We shoot all of our videos in 1080p, 60 frames per second. So if you have HD capabilities on your computer, tablet, smartphone, television, turn them on right now because it is your best way to check out the look, styling, and options of the vehicle before seeing it in person. We're going to go through just about everything on this vehicle. I'm going to go fast because there's a lot to cover. First thing I like to point out is the redesign of the front end. It has the projector lamp, LED headlamps, LED running lights, LED fog lamps. We'll turn those on at the end of the video so you can see how nice and bright those are. You get the new design on the grill. It's kind of a more flat design than the old ones. You can actually see it's a little bit, um, it's almost 90 degrees there. so. Pretty good looking. Lower grille looks pretty good as well. It still has the adaptive cruise controls, the front uh, bumper sensors. This one has the 21 inch painted and polished aluminum rims and it has continental cross contact tires. These are 275 45R21s. You get an all terrain tread pattern on there. This one has the Quadra Track two system, it also has a quadro lift system, um, like the block lettering Grand Cherokee logos there, or lettering, uh, you do get the American flag on there, that's a good look too. And we'll take a look at the original window sticker, feel free, pa feel free to pause this, I'm not going to go through everything, um, but it is a 2021 Grand Cherokee L Summit Reserve, Silver Zenith is the color, global black interior color, Interior is Palermo leather seats, 3.6 liter, eight speed automatic. Everything on the left are your standard features. Um, I did notice that a new one on here is drowsy driver detection. So you can tell when somebody's falling asleep at the wheel, apparently it'll alert you. Interior features, this one has the Uconnect 5 navigation system with the 10.1 inch display, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, which are now Bluetooth capable. Nine amplified speakers with subwoofer and everything on there is your standard equipment. A lot of that is null and voided by the Summit Reserve Group 22U, which is a $3,000 option. Gives you those 21 inch rims, the Palermo leather seats, the 19 speaker high performance Macintosh audio system, active noise control system, 950 watt amplifier, vented rear seats, deluxe headliner, Palermo leather door trim, this one has the Advanced Protect Group, which is a $19.95 option. Gives you heads-up display, night vision with pedestrian and animal detection, rear view, auto dimming, digital mirror display, interior rear-facing interior, rear camera, and luxury tech group, which gives you the wireless charging pad and manual second row window shades. Total MSRP is $66,275. If you want to check out um, all the pricing on this one in the upper right-hand part of the screen, there's a link to our website to get all your Summit uh, discounts and rebates. Three year 36 bumper to bumper, five year 60 powertrain. Your fuel economy is right there 25 highway, 18 city, 21 average, and it's not rated for government crash test ratings just yet. We'll get back to this interior, which is pretty awesome, but I just wanted to come around to the back. First off, four wheel disc brakes. They haven't changed that. The back styling, I believe, is really good. LED tail lamps. You get the uh, dual exhaust tips right there. Has a towing package, so it gives you receiver hitch, four pin and seven pin wiring. Um, you get the L logo there, signifying that it has the third row. Backup parking sensors, and you get the Summit Grand Cherokee um, badge right there. Kind of hard to see the Grand Cherokee in there. 
I wish they would have made that a little bit different color and the L logo. I could take it or leave it. I do like the new button for the back that uh, pops up pretty nicely. There's your cover for the receiver hitch. That works just like they always have with those four tabs at the top and the two screws in. Um, there's storage underneath here and that's also where your jack tools are and to get to your spare tire. So these are power third row seats and all you have to do is press these buttons right here and they will go down. They are not the fastest, but they go down nice and smoothly. And then you can put that second row down as well by pressing one of these buttons. We'll do the driver's side. And you can see that those go down pretty nice and flat as well. Uh, because this one has a center console, it'd be kind of hard to slide things up there, but you get the idea. To get these seats back up, you just press these buttons again and they'll come on back up. Like I said, they're not the fastest, but they do go up very nice and smooth. To get this gate down, you press that button. It'll beep at you three times like they always have. On the third time, it'll come on down. It actually beeps at you a total of four times. Um, backup parking sensors back here still has the capless fuel fill, which is a nice feature. Um, you do get the heated mirrors, blind spot monitoring, directional signals on there. But now this is really, and this is the Summit Reserve, so you know this is the top of the line, the best that Jeep has to offer on this vehicle. And you can see that it is fantastic. You get the quilted leather, the Palermo seats. Give that silver piping on there. Both these seats are heated, cooled, and they also have a new feature on this Grand Cherokee redesign, massaging backrests, which pretty amazing. Auto headlamps, power tilt, power telescopic steering wheel. The other great thing about this Summit Reserve package is look at this wood grain trim. This is this is real wood. This is not, you know, fake wood. This is this is real. I mean, it looks as real as you can get. So really cool, you get the quilted leather door inserts, power windows, power locks, power mirrors. These mirrors do power fold in. I have yet to figure out how to get that to happen, but it's new. So you got your memory driver's seat and then you have your massaging backrest button right there. We'll hop inside, take a look at the all new instrument cluster, the all new radio for this Grand Cherokee. And you can see that that entire screen is lit up, which is really cool. Um, you get your uh, speedometer on there, your digital speedometer, your digital instrument cluster. You can change your views by pressing this button and then it'll bring up all your different screens that you can have and then you just toggle with the buttons over there and whichever one you select, you just hit enter and it'll go to it. Uh, the steering wheel is redesigned this year. So you get the wood grain trim on there, the black trim as well. Up here, your instrument controls, is, of course, and then your Bluetooth controls, paddle shifters, audio controls on the back. Still get the thumb pads on there. You get the adaptive cruise control. This is for active driving assist and lane detection. So that's what that button does there. And now here is the you connect five 10 inch, 10.1 inch radio, has the factory navigation system on it, AM, FM, Sirius XM radio capabilities. Um, there's really a lot to go through on this radio. You can connect your cell phone to it from Bluetooth um, and run Android Auto or Apple CarPlay through Bluetooth onto the radio. So that is really cool. You have your different comfort settings right here including your massaging seats. You can select um, what you want, if you want it on, if you want it on high, medium, low, driver, passenger, really, really cool. And then you have your rear controls right there for your air, digital, um, dual climate controls. You can do all your climate controls down there as well. And the other really cool thing about this vehicle are all the cameras that you can do. So you have the forward facing camera, which if you're off road, uh, those are dynamic grid lines. They kind of show you where you're going to be driving to. 
and then you have your backup camera there as well and uh, you can zoom in over your receiver hitch to get hooked up to your boat camper trailer the first time every time this one will haul 6200 pounds with the 36 in it and it had with the 57 hemi you'd haul up to 7200 pounds so uh, definitely uh, useful there you also have your surround view camera and uh, one thing about the the camera is it's hd now a lot of the jeeps had gone to hd the grand cherokee was behind because it hadn't been redesigned yet but now that it's redesigned you get that hd camera you get the 360 camera there as well you can do a narrow view in back a wide view in back a wide view in front or a narrow view in front or you can just go to your backup camera again so it's really cool you can get all to all those cameras from here and then the last thing i want to show you is the fam cam which is really cool so you got kids they're fighting or they're just not behaving you want to see who's doing it well the guys in the third row seat they're, they're the ones making the trouble nope what about the second row okay now you can zoom in on each individual seat as you can see on the right there which is really cool too uh, so just a lot of really neat stuff you can do with this radio um, too much to go over in this video you get your start stop capabilities lane departure stability control your parking sensors and your perpendicular and parallel park assist down here you get two usbs two usb c's an aux jack wireless cell phone charge pad this is your quadra track 2 system everything's just like it used to be um, except it's different buttons and toggle switches now to get in the snow mode you just press it up like so you have also a four-wheel drive low mode a sport mode your neutral setting for flat towing and your downhill assist control this is for your ride height control and if we press that up i'll show you you can actually see the vehicle raising like so you can go to normal ride height or you can go to off-road mode one and that button or that light right there indicates that you're going up and you can physically see it going up and then there's off-road mode two key fobs are different this year they're a rectangular key fob i kind of like them they're nice and chunky they look really good uh, easy unlock lock remote start power rear gate very easy and good looking this one also has the new ambient lighting as you can see underneath that wood grain trim you get a red light now you can change those colors to pretty much anything you want um, but let's just take one second to look at this dash and how nicely it's laid out everything flows really good into the door almost seamless um, especially on this summit reserve package it's just really a good looking interior on top of that you have the premium headliner which is the suede headliner this one also has the panoramic uh, sunroof and second row fixed glass your controls up here are very similar to the ones um, on the new ram and g products assist and sos buttons map lights and then your sunroof and sunshade controls it has the home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lane systems has the rear view camera um, mirror so you can have it as a camera so it's actually taking a video of what's behind you or you can have your normal mirror and um, that's a really neat system the other interesting thing is that this one has the heads up display which is a new option on the grand cherokees and you have your digital speedometer in the windshield we'll take a quick look at the back seats and then we'll walk around the vehicle with all the lights on here so the second row seats that seat is down um, put it up like so and uh, you get the same trim back here back here your rear air controls heated and cooled seat buttons you get two more usbs two more usb c's another 115 volt 150 watt plug-in um, everything's trimmed out the same it does have the side window shades which is new on the grand cherokees obviously for this year which is a nice feature to have especially if it's very sunny where you live and you have young children that trim is the same on the back doors i do like that the macintosh logo lights up there to get to that third row you just grab this handle right here and that seat will actually slide up and kind of stay there notice you do get the berber floor mats back here 
and they're pretty similar to the Durangos as far as um, how you get into them and the room back here. I'm actually going to hop in here. It's pretty easy to get into. I'm six foot. And if I'm sitting back here, my knees are not touching the uh, seat in front of me. They're close, but they're not touching. So, I mean, like I could ride comfortably back here. The other nice thing is that you get a, you get a USB and a USB-C charger on both sides. So if you do have smaller kids back here, they can charge their electronic devices and whatnot. And if you're wondering where that fam cam is, it's right there. And you can see that suede premium headliner. Seats are pretty comfortable. And I'll hop out here. It's not too hard to get out. And to get that seat back, all you gotta do is press it down. And the other thing about these second row seats is that they slide up and back. You do get the nice center console there. There's a little bit of storage in there as well. And uh, you get the ambient lighting in the back as well underneath the seats. And as promised, I'll do one more final walk around here with all the lights on for you. LED tail lamps look really good. Notice the black, gloss black painted roof. Get the roof rack rails up there. And just a really good job on the redesign from the exterior to the interior. I think this was very well thought out. It was a long time coming and they, I believe they really knocked it out of the park on this particular um, redesign. And I'd like to personally thank you for checking out the video, hopefully from this HD video. You'll have gotten a really good look at the all new Jeep Grand Cherokee L in silver Zenith metallic. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got it. Go to that website right there, www.summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Remember to like, subscribe, and share, and click the bell notifications on this video and all the videos that you see there. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to our YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to more Jeep Cran Cherokee videos like this one in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. Remember to like, subscribe, and share. We do videos each and every day. Click those bell notifications and you'll get updated every time we post one of those videos. Thanks again, and we're super excited to be offering the new Jeep lineup, which includes the 2021 Jeep Grand Cherokee L in silver Zenith Metallic. Thanks again for checking out the video.